Good Monday morning. I'm Frida and I have a haul for you today and this is a Monday morning Audi haul. Uh, just a quick one and I thought I'd show you what I got. Um, it's raining so I didn't want a large haul. I just got a few things. I found a half gallon of fat-free cultured buttermilk for pancakes and biscuits. It was under $2, maybe a dollar seventy or something like that. And there's a gallon of organic milk for five eighty-nine. Um, I haven't found gallons of organic milk at Aldi before, so that's a first. I've always found the half gallons. And I have a package of cilantro. It's very affordable at Aldi. Um, probably less than 99 cents. I I didn't look exactly. And I found, got this Sweet Heat barbecue rub. My kids love this on popcorn. When I make popcorn, they like this spice. It's a little spicy and a little sweet. And it is a barbecue rub. But they like it on popcorn. So get what they like. <laughs> Of course, these cucumbers are inexpensive. They're, they're under $3 for a bag like this. They're nice little crunch in a salad. Excuse me, I need some water. And I found some shock sugar sauce to make eggs with. I don't remember the price. It was two something, I believe. It's called breakfast sauce, and it's a Middle Eastern, it's this tangy and savory Middle Eastern style spiced sauce. So I, I'm going to read the recipe back here and follow the recipe to make the, um, for the, for my family. And this is a, um, classic savory Mexican style sauce with onion and spicy peppers and it's for huevos rancheros crazy eggs <laughs> um yes that i i love uh huevos locos and i'm going to use this sauce for huevos locos um it looks like huevos rancheros have like small round corn tortillas but huevos locos has rice on the side and then it has beans and eggs and I believe it has a little cheese sauce, but I, I won't add that. I'll use avocado and eggs. It's so good. I, I've had it one time at my favorite Mexican restaurant in Columbia, Kentucky. And I, I like to copy that recipe because it's easy and it's delicious. And I um, found some raw honey at Aldi. It's uh, lightly strained and it is unfiltered. So I needed honey. Uh, it was $6 and something for this little bottle. It was, it's 24 ounces. But I usually go for a, like a quart or a half gallon of honey at a time because we really go through honey at my house. But today I just got what Aldi had. And this is a lettuce. This lettuce is a must have here. We go through a lot of it. My kids like the taste of this lettuce. I chop it up real small to make their salads and they, they like it. And I can also tear off a leaf to put on a sandwich. And the flavor of that lettuce is, of romaine lettuce is slightly sweet. So the kids don't mind eating their lettuce. And I got some barbecue onion rings. I, I saw those last week or two weeks ago and I waited and so today I got some. I'm going to have those for my lunch. I'm going to toast them in the oven. And I got seedless raisins. My husband likes to put a little raisins in his savory rice dishes and with fish when he fries fish. He likes to fry onions and raisins together with, with the fish. <laughs> My kids don't like that. I, my husband likes it, and the only thing reason I don't like it is it because it's so oily. He uses a lot of oil for that, 
and I got some crescent rolls from Aldi. Um, I don't like the Aldi crescent rolls as much as the Pillsbury because they're stickier, but they're okay. I mean, after they're cooked, the kids don't know the difference. And I will wrap some vegan sausage in these and bake them with vegan sausage inside. And I always buy this lactose-free milk at Aldi. It's under $3 a box, I think like $2.89 or two, two something. And my third son is lactose intolerant, so he drinks this milk. And I got him some, when I was at Walmart the other day for just a couple of items, I I rarely go to Walmart and it's not even worth it to show a haul because I didn't get that much. But um, I found some cashew chocolate milk and my little one with lactose intolerance, he, he enjoys that, so it's good for him. And I got this organic cranberry 100% juice and I plan to drink this regularly. Um, because my kidneys, I had a kidney stone a few weeks ago, several weeks ago, maybe earlier. I don't remember the date or I don't remember the month, but I did have a kidney stone and I, I thought maybe I should just include some cranberry juice in my diet every day to for kidney health. And I I bought these for $1.87 a bottle and I thought that was a good price for 100% cranberry juice and it's organic and from Ocean Spray. I thought maybe I should have gotten more than three, but I didn't. Maybe I should go back and pick up more because um, it's not a permanent item at Aldi. It's a, um, it's a uh, Aldi find, I guess is what they call it. So they pick up things sometimes that are Aldi finds and then they don't have it on, on the regular. They just have it briefly. And when they're out, they're out. So thank you for watching my little rainy Monday morning haul. And I wish you all a great week. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Bye-bye.